And so how long did you need to do all these roles um, in order until you got your first break? Uh, what, I, what I qualified my first break was my first professional role in, uh, in Australia, in, in Melbourne. And that was at the Department of Justice in 2002. I took on a role as a community corrections officer. Right. So I called that my, as you yes. said, my first professional role and my first break. And, and who did you accredit for giving you that break? Um, I got some really good advice yep. from a person who essentially sat me down and said, does everybody who studies accounting remain an accountant all their lives? Yeah. Yes. No. Um, does everybody who studies <coughs> medicine become a court bearing, white court bearing, you know, general <coughs> practitioner or a surgeon? No. They can do other things. That's it. So why do you think if you studied HR, you have to work in HR? So this person made me think laterally, and he said, your career does not have to be linear. You don't have to think that just because you studied a subject or a course or a, you know, a qualification is gained, you have to immediately get a break and like everyone else, you know, have this linear career. So, so therefore you're saying it's, it's more than just a one-step process? Because we do get a lot of students come to us and say that they studied accounting, therefore they want a job as, a, as an accountant. But perhaps it's a two-step process and they're not going to get that job straight away. And that perhaps they're going to have to do some work with the Uber Eats guys. Yeah, or, <laughs> they, didn't, yeah. they didn't exist back then. No. So I did what I did. No, you had to go pick up your takeaway yourself, which was terrible. But now, <laughs> now we've got these guys who can, can help out with that. Exactly. So part of the advice I got from yeah. this person was really good. He opened my eyes to thinking laterally about my career okay. and said, go and pick up a role in any organisation where you will have a opportunities, you'll have a career, yeah. and so that's what I did.